A new partnership is taking off between two Fox Valley colleges. UW Oshkosh and Fox Valley Technical College are teaming up for a new aviation program. The new offering comes with a pilot shortage on the horizon. Fox 11's Ben Krumholtz has more. Majors Through plans. UW Oshkosh, aviation graduates from Fox Valley Technical College like Cody Shire will now have the opportunity to fly higher in their careers. First time I saw a plane, I was just bitten by the aviation bug. Starting this fall, Shire and other technical school graduates will be able to take an online aviation management program through UW Oshkosh. It's so convenient, the fact of I can be working, building my hours, and still be going to school at the same time. The four-year program opens up more doors. It gives them, uh, our, the graduates a leadership background so that they can move up and advance within their companies and become the, the next generation of leaders in aviation. With a lot of the hands-on learning done at the technical college level, instructors say it works to have the new program be online. Our graduates really find themselves all over the world, and that's the nice thing about this offering is while they're out there in industry working, gaining experience, and providing for their families, they're able to continue their education 100% online from anywhere in the world. The offering might be taking off at just the right time. An industry forecast shows nearly 500,000 pilots will be needed through the year 2030 worldwide. We're at the front end right now. That that spike is, is forecast to start this year to next year. While FVTC aviation graduates could fill those jobs immediately, the new UW Oshkosh program has potential to open better opportunities. The best jobs are for commercial airlines, and commercial airlines will not even look at a candidate until they have a bachelor's degree. It is partly the reason Shire is on board. I don't want to sell myself short and close the door when, it's, when I can just open more doors. In Oshkosh, Ben Krumholz, Fox 11 News.